take a video. Say hi. Hi. Hi, where are we? And Graham's house. Yeah, we're still at Graham's and Graham's house, huh? Yeah, we're just hanging out. We just had lunch. We had some mac and cheese. Mustard. Porter loves mac and cheese. Me too. And Grayson does too. Yep, so we're just hanging out. It's very hot outside, so we're staying inside today, huh? Good morning, afternoon. It's 11.30, so almost the afternoon. Like I said earlier, we are still at my parents' house. I don't know how I'm gonna do all these videos, so bear with me, but we are still at my parents' house. One week from today, we get the keys to our new house. So it's kind of crunch time. Anthony and I went yesterday to our old house, current house, whatever you wanna call it, and we did some more packing. A lot of rooms are done. The only thing we still need to do is like pack stuff in the kitchen. Um, we gotta pack closets, everybody's closet. And I don't know what else. Not much more. So, um, almost done with the packing. And then today, Anthony and I are going to go look at couches. We need a new couch for our living room. It's huge. We have a tiny couch that we're just going to put in our basement. And it's broken and old. So, we're going to get a new couch. We were planning on waiting until we sold our current house. Um, but update on that, we have not sold it yet. It is still on the market. Um, we have had 20 plus showings and not one single offer, which is like super annoying. We have one more showing today, so we'll see how that goes. But if not, maybe we'll talk about dropping the price or something. I'm not sure, but that's been super frustrating. Hence why we're still at my parents' house because we can't go to either house right now. Um, so we're still staying with my parents. I'm sure we're getting on their nerves by now. Um, but my parents are going to go and pick up. We have a trailer, but it's in Toledo, like two hours away. So they're going to go get that today. So we have that to move. We're hopefully going to find a couch and maybe a table because we need a new kitchen table. We need rugs too, but like I feel like I need to be in the house to look at rugs. So I don't know what we're going to do about that. So just trying to get everything um, figured out on the limited funds we have from buying our new house. So yeah, and like I said, it's, it's super hot out today. It's supposed to be like 94, 93 today. So we're just gonna stay inside and just kind of hang out. The boys are um, playing in my parents' bed, making a mess. We're gonna have to clean that. You guys, stop making a mess. They love laying in my parents' bed. I don't know why, but they love it. Thank you, Gray. So, yeah, just kind of still in limbo, but getting closer to at least getting into our new house. There is the possibility that the current people could move out of our new house early, and we are hoping, hoping that they do, just so that we can start this move process a lot sooner. Um, but we just don't know yet. If anything, they have to be out by Sunday. Um, so we've got all that going on. Um, so it's going to be a busy week of just like packing and trying to get everything ready. Um, our anniversary is on the 30th. So that's next Saturday. So it's like less than a week away. I already, I have one of Anthony's gifts. I need to wrap it. And then the other one, I, I, I'll tell you guys. So for, we do traditional gifts for anniversaries. So this is our sixth year wedding anniversary. And so the gift is iron and candy. So for iron, I got Anthony a cast iron skillet because he asked for that like a forever ago. So I got him that. It was like 20 bucks on Amazon. I got it on Amazon Prime Day. So I got it at a discount. And then for the candy, I'm going to do one of those cards where like you make sentences, but you fill in some of the words with candies. So I'm going to do that. Um, so I bought the cast iron skillet. I need to wrap it. I'm going to do that this week while Anthony's at work. And then I need to go buy the candy and like a poster board to make the card. And then I'll be done with that. So that'll be good. And then, yeah, just getting everything ready. Hopefully we find a couch we like today. That's not too expensive. Um, otherwise, we're just going to be sitting on the floor in the living room <laughs> until we ha have funds for a couch. So a little stressful. I really wish we were in contract on our house. It's just not happening like we had hoped it to. Um, so please send good thoughts this way that, you know, somebody puts a bit on it soon because we are tired of having this old house. We're ready to get rid of it. Um, the only plus about like having this sit on the market for so long is 
I feel like when it finally does sell, I will not be sad to see it go. I will be happy and done with it. I feel like if it went like right off the bat, right when we put it up, I would feel sad. Like, oh, it's actually really desirable and everybody wants it and we should have kept it. But now I'm seeing that nobody wants it. We don't want it. And so I will not miss it <laughs> once it's gone. And I'm very excited to get into her new house. Grayson is constantly asking when we get to go to the new house, and um, I think the kids don't like being in limbo either. They've been kind of more fussy and cranky. Gray has been sleeping horribly here. Um, he gets up several times a night to come wake us up because we don't have his clock, which has the red and the green light. He doesn't have the lock on the door, so it's been a struggle. So we are just all ready to be done with this limbo and to be into our new house. So fingers crossed that we get keys um, soon. <laughs> Um, but I'll definitely keep you updated. I'll try and vlog a little bit when we go shopping for couches. We're going to look for a couch and possibly a kitchen table. But if we don't find the kitchen table, then that's okay. Um, really, we need a couch. Otherwise, we're sitting on the floor for a while. 